This week on Commander Clash, we're having ChatGPT build us our Commander decks. What's everyone running today? I'm Seth and I asked ChatGPT what the worst Panharmonicon Commander was and it told me it was Squee the Immortal, so of course, I had to build me a Squee Panharmonicon deck. Hi, I'm Richard and I'm playing Muldrotha the Gravetide. I asked ChatGPT to help me build a deck to crush my friends Saffron Olive, Budget Commander, and Brewer's Kitchen and this is what it came up with. Hey, this is Phil and ChatGPT must have known that I'm filling in for Krim because it gave me Kess, Dissident Mage, and a very Grixis pile of cards. Hey, it's Tomer, and I'm putting ChatGPT to the ultimate test by forcing it to build me the most powerful Cauldre deck possible. Let's see if AI is truly up to the task. But before we jump into the game, a quick reminder that you can support the channel by purchasing your cards at cardkingdom.com slash mtggoldfish, buying our merch at mtggoldfishmerch.com, and liking and subscribing to help the channel grow. Alright, with the intros out of the way, let's hop into the game. Alright, we are jumping into the game. Everybody kept the starting seven. I'm going first. And to kick things off, uh, I don't remember who died first last game. <laughs> we, gotta clash have, on! we gotta clash We need an AI voice to say it. We need like some mechanical oh, yeah. clash on. Clash yeah. on. <laughs> Our error. Clash All right, we'll just on. AI <laughs> voices are pretty good nowadays. <laughs> 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 They don't, they don't all sound like what was they it, probably Stephen, sound better than Stephen us. Stephen Hawking. They probably do. They can I actually if they can sound, sound exactly like us. like us. Yeah, especially. Oh, do you think our voices are there? We have a lot of YouTube content. Maybe, maybe. Yeah, right. I mean, right. there, you you use our voice time to deep fake the commander yeah. Clash. Yeah. Yeah. Deep deep fake, fake our, our voices <laughs> to do a commander Clash game. Can you imagine that? We just do uh, an entire deep fake. Yes. We should. Well, that'd be, that, we we that should. Be we should replace ourselves with VTubers as well. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we go full anime. All right. Uh, I just played uh, Mario Skyrim. This is uh This is gonna be an interesting, interesting experiment. A, how did you, how did all of you this. think your decks ended up being? Uh, very stapley. Oh, very win condition. -y. Yeah. So I think I. I I was too hard on it, I think, because my deck is horrible. <laughs> <laughs> I just, my deck is it. really good because it just took staples, I think. I think no oh, matter what yeah. deck, so whatever commander oh, you yeah, asked okay. for, it, it gave you like a very popular, powerful commander. And then most of the deck was filled with like the staple cards. Uh -huh. so, uh, but you all have pretty good commanders, right? You got Mandrawal, so that's like a top 10 yeah. commander. Kath is like a top 10 commander. Balin is like a known commander. Yeah. I think it struggled with mine because what are staples for Squee and Panharmonic on? <laughs> so I have like, you'll see as I start to play my cards, many of the cards in my deck, some of them are very good cards. They just <laughs> don't really make sense with so, yeah. Squee or Panharmonic on. And some of them just make no sense at all. Like I have no idea why they put them in my deck. I'm glad. I'm glad ChatGPT has my back on Explorer Scope. Highly underrated. <laughs> yeah, I mean, That's so far this looks like a deck comments. Tomer would play. Yeah, Maria, Miss Blades, Explorer Scope. Okay. <laughs> this so this I looks like know. a reasonable deck. I don't know how the process worked for you all, but it got it was very difficult to get it. First of all, Commander legal. But even when I did get a Commander legal, like yes, half the half the deck seems like pretty legitimate, but for some reason. They added a lot of cards for aura support. Now, keep in mind, my deck has like two auras in the entire deck, but it was running like Core Spirit Dancer, draw a card whenever you're playing an aura. And not, not like equipment or anything, just auras. And there was like another one that was like, um, like return an aura from the graveyard to the battlefield under, like under your control and stuff like that. So it was like very perplexing stuff. Like it's, it, it doesn't feel, it feel, I thought maybe it would be like just an EDH Rex sample deck, but it's not because it has like these wild <laughs> cards that you would never find in an EDH Rex sample deck, I don't think. Okay, it's, so. it's first victory. I cracked so. Polluted Delta and I'm able to <clears throat> find a, a green source. Hey, nice. <laughs> hey. That, that, that was the first risky move here to see if it <laughs> gave me <laughs> fetchable yeah. lands in the colors that I needed. It did. Okay. Ooh, this Here's the second check. Color. Do Whoa. I have basics? Oh. Do I have basics? I Find can say out. for sure that I don't have basics. Good luck. Oh, thank goodness oh, I have basics. Full okay. it? Richard's have like basics. going off. Y'all look like you're playing real decks so they, far. These kind of do look like real decks, right? Yeah. There's so, some, there's so some whammies in this deck, though. <laughs> I mean, I, I gave it a lot of prompts trying to get yeah. a deck, and it always gave me something really strong. Like, I asked it for a deck to get a million YouTube views, and it gave me... <laughs> 
<laughs> it gave me like Yuriko. And then I, I asked like, okay, give me a deck to hit on that 90s nostalgia. And it gave me Sliver Queen. Okay, so that's really it, it's like generally in the right ballpark, but a lot of the times the deck was either like too expensive or it was like not wrong. close enough to deck. Like it had like eight lands and then yeah, I had so- a really hard time getting it to get to the right number of lands because when, when it adds lands, it starts adding lands outside color identity and stuff like that. Mm-hmm. And then so it was weird. I, I have to play this card and I, I this is one I cannot figure out. Squee, Panharmonicon, like. Why? It's Sundial Sun. <laughs> what? It's, what? It's what? Very, it's it's a very popular list red card. This on? So. It's not. Is it even a popular red? Ooh. Like, For all why your would I want to end my turn? Why would I want to end my turn? <laughs> I'm trying I don't to understand how deck. they how they got to Sundial the Infinite for my deck. Like at all. I'm drawing the good half of my deck for sure. The the planes. They're pretty yeah, decent. The planes. Uh, oh, no, Pierce Paladin. Paladin. This, is, this is so far looking like we're gonna game. we're gonna equip the Pierce Paladin with the Scope combo. Okay, everyone but Seth has had a legitimate opening. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. So I have a question for you all. Like we're, we built all chat, we built Alex through Chat GPT, and I assume most of us haven't really had that much experience with Chat GPT. Probably our uh, viewers either have not ever made a deck uh, through it. How would you say the process was? Was it good? Was it easy to make a deck through through ChatGPT as your first time? Ooh, so, okay. I think ChatGPT is actually pretty good at being like a, a like EDH rec that can have a conversation with you. If you want to be like, hey, I'm building a black deck. What are some good black cards for Commander? It did pretty well with that. But mm-hmm. as far as actually ending up with a legal playable deck... It is. I keep seeing these articles about like, oh, chat GPT, AI going to take over all the jobs. And I was like, boy, is this a risk? Am I going to lose my job? Because pretty soon AI is going to be doing all the brewing. And uh, yeah. I am <laughs> I'm feeling a little better after this process because it did. It was a lot of work to actually build a deck. And the deck, I don't think, actually turned out <laughs> all so, that good. <laughs> the problem is with AI is that it can't really do creativity. It can only reproduce stuff that it's seen and mix and mash them. So mm-hmm. I don't know. Deck building isn't too 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 creative. It won't probably won't come up with combos unless it learns the rules of magic and can try things. <laughs> then it can come up with combos pretty easily. That will be scary. Humor, for example, mm-hmm. will be hard to recreate with ChatGPT. The thing is, I I just ask it for my yeah, deck. Hey, do you know what commander is? And then it says, Yeah, it's this. And then I said, Hey, what's a commander <laughs> that I want to play? And it said, Cass. Uh, sure. <laughs> they, thought you were, so, they thought you were Crim, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's weird. So the first actually, thing it was, said, like, that was Crim's account, actually. Yeah. <laughs> so, so, actually, you know what? So the one of the first questions I asked it was how to beat my friends, and then you guys on Commander Clash. And it yeah. said so it knew you guys were content creators. Like to Uh-oh. beat powerful content creators, you oh, okay. should play this deck. And it gave me a Crim deck. It gave me Azorius Control. <laughs> and I wonder if it knew that Crim normally plays with us and t- Crim normally plays Control. <laughs> I wonder a... it might. <laughs> so the, the what thing was... about it is I, it took quite some time until I had a playable deck. So first of all, it threw in Eternal Witness and mm. Cultivate into my decks, which is probably because it just <laughs> scours the internet for popular magic cards. Then I asked it to remember what the color identity means and what's the color identity of Cass and stuff. Then I had a 14 land deck. And then I told it, hey, <laughs> please, at least 36 <laughs> lands and some mana rocks. <laughs> Funnily enough, it matched the mana rocks. Like I, I said, artifacts that produce mana. And then it gave me mana rocks in my color identity. So I, I added. Oh. So in the primer, there's the ChatGBT discussion I had with it. Uh, so if you're yes. interested to see where how yeah, I got we added here. our we um, added our chat logs. I didn't oh, oh, my goodness. No. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> that was pretty good. To- this is looks right. like a deck Tomer. Are you sure that maybe they built Tomer's <laughs> deck based budget? on a deck Tomer played okay. in the past? Yeah. I'll, I'll give a I'll give a context on how I built the deck. So I said, Hey chat GPD, I want the commander legal deck that features Helm of Cauldra, Shield of Cauldra, and Sword of Cauldra. <laughs> and it immediately gave me Balan Wandering Knight, which was like, oh my god, that's actually that's that that's legitimate. Like that's a legitimate uh, equipment deck. Um and then half the deck was filled with uh aura support cards, but no auras. And I was like, okay, that's 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 fine. At least at least like at least I got some of it right. Um 
But it, the, the deck was not commander legal because it kept giving a duplicates. And I said, like, it has to be singleton. Remove yeah. duplicate copies except for planes. And it, it said, like, yeah, we'll do that. And, and then it didn't. And then I was like, it has to be a 100-card deck, 99 cards in the deck, one commander. Um, and it's like, yeah, yeah, yeah sure, we'll, we'll make it 100 <laughs> cards. But it kept giving me, like, 89, 107. <laughs> so, like, it, 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 it will respond correctly to my requirements, but then it will just not do the thing. Oh, all right. I'm attacking Richard because he's open. Um, and I didn't hit a land. But I, mean. I think I think my favorite part also, like, since it's trained on information from the internet and you asked it for a for a cauldra deck it probably is based on your content i assume like 90 percent of the cauldra content on the internet probably comes from tomer so you might have had an influence on your your own deck my favorite part though is just like how apologetic it is it like keeps messing up and it'll be like no 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 like can you please can you please like give me you know take these two duplicate cards out and it's like oh i'm so sorry like my apologies like it's like so overly apologetic whenever you have to correct it was it was it as over the word. Just was it difficult for, for you guys to uh, get it to finally make a commander legal deck? Because that was the hardest thing. Yeah. Eventually, I just I, I broke down and like it kept putting Sun Home Fortress of the Legion in my in my mono white deck, which is not commander legal. I was just like I had to be like remove Sun Home, add planes. Like I couldn't <laughs> I could not word my suggestions in a way to make it commander legal in the end. I, I, I got <laughs> super close. There were two duplicate cards, uh, two lands, Valica and Flamekin Village that were duplicate, and it just couldn't understand. So eventually I was like, you can only play one of each. Will you please like remove these and play? <laughs> tell me something to replace them with? And then it got there. Although <laughs> I ended up with 48 lands altogether. I feel like my wow. A was trained on EDH Rec and Sam Black's Twitter. Like those are the two <laughs> sources that led to my <laughs> that led to my deck. <laughs> my, my 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 chat GPT just did not believe in lands. Like I had to, it didn't put any planes initially, and I was like, <laughs> make thirty seven lands and X amount of planes, and it never gave me thirty seven lands. So I think I'm like thirty six lands actually. That's a interesting question. Like how how specific were you with it? Because I tried to be very broad and not be like, give me ten mana rocks, give me this number of something. I need more removal. Like give me some rats. I I tried mm-hmm. to be really broad and not direct it too much. How how specific were? <laughs> Are you reanimating? <laughs> Sorry, it's it's together. Together. Okay. Wait, how did it only return to your hand? Oh, okay. yeah. Return to hand. How specific did you have to be? Like, were you like, give me five removal spells, give me ten mana rocks, give me? I only had to be specific. Uh, Mystic Remora. Jesus. Oh, oh, oh! I hope you guys have non-creature spells. <laughs> yeah, good. No, don't worry. I don't <laughs> the have. Mystic Remora is very good apparently. for Mold Growth. Uh, yeah, so yeah, the that just problem keeps coming back. For me, it looked like I had a lot of spells, so I might just be drawing the wrong cards, but I kind of was hoping for some mill, maybe some spells to flash back with Cass. Yeah, Not so yeah. far. I know that I'm playing <laughs> Lightning Bolt and Thoughtseize. Uh, very crim to play <laughs> Thoughtseize on the uh, and commander. Except end the turn. You got to use the cards. Let's go. <laughs> you do not have. What if we it. ask Chat GPT if you is should there... activate Sundial the Infinite? <laughs> is there a way I can resolve my spell and end the turn before Mystic Remora trigger resolves? That no, doesn't work. Because does it? So the tri- Mystic Remora trigger resolves first. However, I will give you an offer. Uh, mm-hmm. I will remove the Mystic Remora on my turn and draw Richard a single card in the process. So you just have to delay Ooh. for one turn. Just just pay right. the four. What are you doing? I mean, I, mean, I, wanna... so I have I have returned to dust in my hand. I can oh. exile the. No, he's, whoa, he's gonna whoa. kill your sundial. You're not gonna get my sundial, are you? <laughs> no, I, I have your sundial. I have plans for that. Okay, I'll, I'll play. Oh. I'll play a Cranko then, oh, which oh, I guess fair. is in the deck because squeeze a goblin. I don't squeeze know what it has to do with Panharmonicon, but yeah, you I, make I guess the that's the idea. No, it's an ETB trigger. It doesn't even double. <laughs> oh. It's not a Cranko's not an ETB, so we'll see. All right, here go. Okay. So, would you recommend someone watching build a deck this way? Like, yeah. is it's it just yeah? It's it's, it's too EDH, too much effort. Like, I mean, it's right, kind of going... cool, as you said, to have like a conversation with it because it does have some merit if you ask it. Hey, how I I don't know how important is That's interaction in Commander. Uh, like it will Pretend tell you how exile, important it is. Remora and a like stone. This. 
Okay. All right. Are you going to pay the four? I will not. You can you can draw a card. <laughs> can I pay the four? I knew I had to get I had to get this out of the way ASAP oh. or else like Seth would just like go out. Yeah, ne- next turn I'm casting a non creature, ready or not. I like it, it also, exiles uh, too, which is relevant with Madralta. Yeah, it also exiles too, which well. is very good. Oh, and dip, 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 dip. Return oh, to dust. You don't you don't see this card very often anymore. It used to be <laughs> yeah. like Power a cuts. decade ago, very very popular. <laughs> I think right. that's a chat GPT thing, too, because apparently it stopped training on data in like 2021 or something. So if you have staples from like two or three years ago, oh, is those really? are like oh, in its brain, like the staples. Yeah. I have no new cuts, I think. I'll smack. I'll smack. Yeah, I don't think I have any new cards either. Uh, I'll smack uh, Seth for for. for I'm starting oh. the love. I attacked Richard last turn and I just. <gasps> Mora. Oh, no. Yes. Look at the Mora scope. This is why the scope is so freaking it's good. Two swings. If for two mana, it's essentially a rampant growth that is like plus, plus, plus. I hit a scavenging grounds off the top. And I love scavenging it, grounds. <laughs> it's a rampant growth 50% of the time or 35% of the time or something, right? Well, it like, can, it, a rampant goes plus, 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 right? Because like, you can keep swinging. But you could keep whiffing. Yeah, but, <laughs> I mean, you, you got to keep hitting, though. That's part of the fun. <laughs> you don't always have an indestructible 4-2. Yeah, you yeah, don't want to block if you're a squee. I thought that's the whole point of the deck. I, yeah. I got a Cranko now. I I need that extra goblin <laughs> token. <laughs> right. Well, I have I have some some defenses. I'm gonna play Maze of Ith. Ooh. Ooh, saucy. And then we will pass. That's if it. I draw another land, I'm like a just gonna here. cry. I know. <laughs> wait, no, wait, I don't, I don't, I, where's the first weird card that we're gonna? I don't see? play Maze of Ith. <laughs> I don't actually like Maze of Ith that much. Huh. Pretty pretty good if you're explorer scoping every turn though. You can yeah. you can afford a land that doesn't tap for mana. Yeah. Well, I guess I will get something. I don't know. I'm just going to check what ChatGPT got for me, but there's got to be a reason for this. Hopefully. <laughs> Dark Petition. Dark just petition. Like a five mana <laughs> demonic tutor. Just yes. five mana Wait, raw tutor. You, you don't have a graveyard. Right? Something. So you don't even get it. Yeah, so. it doesn't have a graveyard, so it doesn't nope. get any mana back. Okay. Viewers. It is good with cast, though. What do we get here? This looks pretty good. You. Oh, oh, Phil, you got to ask ChatGPT. Oh, no. Yeah, ask ChatGPT if you want I, to turn I Ask him what to take, what to take. <laughs> I'm not sure if I have the conversation. Open. I don't even know if it would remember. Yeah, that's what, that's what if I have the same conversation, I can probably say, name one of those cards, and then it does it. Yeah. But I, I probably can't do this. Or I you have to like paste this. the entire deck list and be like, Name one of these cards and see, keep saying yeah, no. And the and fact that it's going to be some random found. stuff is probably not. I'm just, oh, damn. Chat GBT, you naughty boy. What I are mean, these cards? After <laughs> building our decks, I have less faith in Chat GBT. I, I feel it's the same where if you ask it something, it'll give you like a high level answer that looks loosely correct. But if you're mm-hmm. an expert in the field, you know it's not right. Or you know it's just parroting <laughs> like the most popular information. <laughs> I think I think for so. Commander, like it's good writing Amazon reviews or something, yeah. right? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. To be fair, like Magic is notoriously complex and maybe the hardest game, maybe impossible to actually fi- figure out with AI, uh, at least where we're at right now. So the fact that it actually knows a little bit, not knows, but can reproduce some info about Commander and the format, I think that's already impressive. A lot of people already lost their job because of ChatGPT, which is kind of funny for BuzzFeed journalists because they said truckers to learn how to code so they they don't lose their job to AI, and then they <laughs> lost their job before the truckers. So that is kind of hilarious. <laughs> I guess that's kind of irony. Yeah. Yes, that is very ironic. <laughs> I I think oh, that no, I, I fetched think wrong. These type of programs <laughs> will be able to like make decks, but I don't think there's enough like like training on it yet to do that like if yeah. honestly if you just want and you want just like a computer to auto generate a deck for you edh rec just has like sample deck lists mm-hmm. so you go to a commander you like and then you click like click sample deck list and it just takes like the the, the most okay. commonly played cards from that deck and puts them together and those decks like they're not optimized or anything but they're better than what if you just want to see like 
good cards, it'll show you like the good cards for your. And archetype. it's com- it's a commander legal deck too. That's like the number one thing because like half the battle with, with this was like trying to get a hundred card deck that was like non duplicate, singleton, respected the color identity. I I think I feel like that we'll stuff there. will prove right. Like sooner or later, it's going to learn. Oh, commander means a hundred singleton cards. Like it maybe hasn't yeah. learned that yet, but I assume eventually it'll it'll learn that, or it will learn to pull from like a specific specific sites. You know. Yeah, I'm surprised. It, couldn't it just like copy and paste a deck list it found on the internet? If you're like, I want Squee, couldn't it just like straight up steal someone's deck list? Yeah, but and, it, it knows it nothing like about Google magic features. and it knows nothing about deck lists whatsoever. It knows like the, nothing. the biggest problem I had was it couldn't count cards correctly. So it, it would give me like planes times nine. And then in, in some context, that it would count that as nine cards. In other contexts, it would count it as one card. And it got like very confused as to like what that actually meant. So it's not trained specifically for magic cards, right? Like it knows no. nothing about magic. You just ask Chat GPT. Like you yeah. can ask it about physics or yeah, it knows nothing. Math it can just whatever. reproduce mm-hmm. yeah. from an amalgam- amalgamination of content. But still, it oh, will no. always hit it. Humanity. You actually have the panharmonic. We found the, the panharmonic without the even deck. tutoring for it. <laughs> you found, found it. No, it just it just showed up. I don't know what my deck. Dang. I don't know if I have any ETB triggers, <laughs> but <laughs> I do have a panharmonic on. Okay. <laughs> Uh, you know what? Boom, we're done. Damn. <laughs> wait, wait. <laughs> okay. Yeah. <laughs> Did you have responses? <laughs> no. I wanted you to attack so I could use my maze of it. <laughs> so I I read Seth's <laughs> discussion with ChatGPT. Only the first part, but the first question was, "Hey, what's Commander?" <laughs> the next question is, "Do you know what Panharmonicon is?" <laughs> <laughs> I don't know how all my conversations go. <laughs> <laughs> Look at this. <laughs> so uh, I I was afraid it was going to be too easy, so I asked it what the best Panharmonicon commanders were, and it gave me, like, Yarok and stuff. My guy. Cool. <laughs> Hi. Chat- Maximum Chat- value deal. Oh, and having this. This, <laughs> this card. Oh, yeah, okay. Yeah. Tomer's yeah. going off. Yeah, this is this has been a good draw. I just, Where's I all these like auras keep that you keep talking about? If, is, no, I don't have good auras. 2016 magic going on. I have here. aura support <laughs> though. <laughs> uh, all right, look at that. Day of Judgment still putting in work. I yeah, I wonder if, if the graveyard. If that actually means that it can show newer cards because it was trained until 21 or something, whatever you said. Okay, let's it's so not I think that might be trained. true. That's weird. I thought uh, it would just be One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, it, five, six. Okay. Yeah, also, so if, if I understand it, right? Cards, what is this? Ooh. Tithe. We search a library tithe. for a planes tithe card. Uh, if target opponent controls more lands than you. Oh, it's target opponent. I don't think I've played Tithe in like over a decade, yeah. but it's still a good it card. It used to be good, but now there's search still more for options. Card. All right. Wait, what? It didn't work. You probably search a library for person. Play. It didn't ask oh. me to target anybody. Such a if opponent. target opponent controls more lands than you, it didn't ask me. Is there any no opponent one controls that has more, more lands? lands than you? Yeah, I do. One, two, three, no, four, we, I five, have six. six. Yeah. Oh, you're tied with Richard, but yeah. Oh, I didn't cut the maze of it. Oh my god, I'm an idiot. <laughs> wow. Oh, whatever. Wow. Chat, chat, chat. GT wow. is disappointed in you. Wow. Her. Whatever. <laughs> whatever. I just want to hit a lane drop. Leave me alone. <laughs> Leave me alone. Uh, All right, I'm, I'm spreading the love. Phil chat GPT four. can make the deck, but it can't pilot it for us. <laughs> <laughs> That's the next step. Yeah, chat GPT pilots my the yeah. deck for me. All right, I whiff, but it's fine. Oh, where's where's the rampant growth now, Tomer? I already got growth. it. Oh, this is, is it? gravy. Is this is bonus. <laughs> don't make me. I'll, I'll swing the pure steel. Back I, I'm, the I'm sorry, pure steel. I'm sorry. I don't want to enrage the one person with a creature. Nah, I'm just gonna be the enemy <laughs> starting well, next bye. turn. I think. I assume Phil tutored, right? He's got. Yeah, he has tutored. To something something good. good. I don't even try to achieve my commander's get game plan at this point. I just take the best. Did cards. he say like I want? I want the following cards: Blind, I wish. Um, yeah, I wish. Aminatus <laughs> <laughs> augury. I should just hmm, put some cards in there that end with Trekker. Oh, like <laughs> something. Trekker. Just end up with my. Not even I, I, I tried. I tried asking for a bird deck. And it gave me like four birds. 
<laughs> like it couldn't, it couldn't make a deck. Normally it gives you a hundred there... cards. It gave me like a five card deck. Then I asked it to bring it to a hundred, and it just started adding like random crap that was not burnt. <laughs> <laughs> okay, wow. Is that what start. you tutored for? No, that was in my oh, hand from oh. turn one, but I didn't have plays. But what I tutored for. It oh, should now be he's gonna pretty good. Something that combos with Cass. It's no, I no. I gave up on that. Um, <laughs> let's do this. Is this six? Oh hell yeah, that's a pretty good six drop. Oh, right here. Uh, I mean, I just uh, outpower uh, you well. then. Yeah, I, mm. <laughs> yep. I was feeling really good up until this point. <laughs> yeah, that's what I mean. That uh-huh. I'm. Probably I was feeling uh-huh. great actually. <laughs> Richard could have removal. It's possible. I have. Oh, no, maybe Chet GT did play around the consecrated <laughs> Sphinx. Man. Uh, end the turn. <laughs> 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 yeah, maybe. Maybe you should have held him to that day of judgment. I thought it was a really good play at the time. It looked pretty good. <laughs> at the yeah. time, yeah. It was good, yeah. <laughs> Everybody minus the commander. Minus I the Why do I have any lands? What's wrong with this deck? Yeah. I, mean, I thought he was <laughs> I for missed so many land drops. Because he's Kess. Oh, right. Kess consecrated swings. I mean, I he's, he's holding gonna, like, mana here. That, that's oh, not I suspicious wish. at all, right? Uh, Kess would have counters, right? Is Kess during your turn? Let me read Kess. One string. Oh, your only turn. My turn. So, so it's not that great. Not that good with counters. Terrible. It's not like I built the deck. <laughs> the, I mean, I'm pretty <laughs> sure right. there are counters so we, in here. We will uh, kill the Sphinx. Nah. Cast yeah. Come on, study. Yeah. Yeah. Oh no! Oh, my come God. on! <laughs> come on! Why? GPT with the no cards. I was like, oh, "This Chat GPT's fault." I mean, I play you know, but there's a Sphinx <laughs> out. Why would you play into the Sphinx? Oh, my God, That's yes. the real issue. Because we're gonna do this. Don't you wait. Windfall. <laughs> Seth, yeah, windfall. You, it's up to you after he counters my spell. Count it. <laughs> I, I sadly okay. don't count on it. This oh. time. Sure. Okay, Damn, that's, I that's fine. wish I could reanimate sure. it. Who Ooh. plays Putrefy? Okay. But okay. We're good. So how <clears throat> how are we how are we doing with this Ristic study team? My deal I, as yeah, always. Yeah, I think you should yeah. just cast all, all your spells into it. I will always pay the one <laughs> if everybody else pays the one. That's yeah, it. I can that's, pay the one. that's my deal every time. That's easy to say when you have a indestructible. Seth. I'm not paying the Pure one. Pure Steel Paladin. Are you not paying the one, Richard? Okay. <laughs> no, I'm not don't, the one. don't keep no, the one. No, Richard owns the... Uh, the so he obviously is not paying the one. Don't listen to him. Technicalities so technicalities. Richard's not paying the one, yeah. Oh, come um, on. I believe please. Crib isn't paying the one. I called please, him. I believe not you. paying I believe the one. You, you've evolved as a magic player. Chet, you know better. Wait. I asked well, well, Chad GPT, do you pay the one? I mean... I'm actually going to ask. On Ristic Study... ChatGPT, do you pay the one? It doesn't make pondering. financial I'm sorry, transactions. But I'm, not, I'm not sure what you mean. <laughs> pay the one could be... Could you pay this I'll content? sweeten the pot. <laughs> if you don't pay the one, I'm just going to attack you. Yeah. Until you die. For, well, we don't negotiate <laughs> with terrorists. <laughs> All right. It's, do you pay the one for risk studies? Sweet, sweeten the deal. I am. So if I pay this... So ChatGPT sent a pretty long message, but in the end, it ends with, so in, in the game, it would be up to the player to decide <laughs> if you pay the oh. one. So <laughs> the game a non-answer. Is, you tell me, yeah. <laughs> please so, pay it. <laughs> Come on, you play as a ring as well. Don't keep up one in case you <laughs> want to activate something. <laughs> keep up one in case you get manatized. But what, I, what if you stay in the water that's over manatized you next turn? Would you feel I, foolish? I need to leave up one in case I need to pay the one. Mm-hmm. Uh, <laughs> then how can you end the turn, Seth, if you're tapped out? <laughs> uh, I know. I definitely right, won't I, attack you if you pay the one. I'm not I'm not Ooh, making any pro- I'm not making any promises about the long term, but I, I actually will pay the one this turn. Are you are, are you choose are you choosing dragons because it I'm, works with I'm drawing cards. No, I'm definitely <laughs> definitely on. trying to draw some okay. cards with this outpost siege. Wow, I've paid the one twice in a turn. I actually wait, could wait, have used all my mana to just end you, the Seth. turn right I'm now. That's a you. disaster, Seth. You paid the one twice, just end the turn. And <laughs> <laughs> with the outpost siege on the stack. So yes. wait, what are we picking? Cons? Cons this card draw? All right, mm-hmm. cons. You want dragons. Because dragons are cool. All right, now now we will end the turn. Chat <laughs> GPT has been done good for me today. Damn. The one. 
Tomer's playing um, a very legitimate you? deck. To be honest, I mean, so Tomer far. now has Metalcraft. He's drawn a bunch of cards from Pure Steel, and then he's yeah. now also drawing a card from the Sword of Fire and Ice. Yum, yum, yum. I mean, if you just tell it to play mono white, I, did you? Oh no, you said like as soon as it's mono white and you throw in something with synergy and equipments, and it just picks staples. It should just be a functioning deck at this point. Although at this point it doesn't play new cards. I mean, I feel most of them it just picks staples. You just gotta yeah, if it just picks staples, massage it, it into be, making yeah. it a legal deck. Yeah. Except whatever Seth's playing. I don't know what Seth's yeah, playing. Yeah, Seth's playing. <laughs> 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 well, didn't you say, I want Panharmonicon with Squee? Maybe that kind of trips it up a bit. <laughs> yeah, I mean, then it would just I had, no, no, no. I, and throw them in. <laughs> I asked it what the worst right, Panharmonicon back. commander was, because I thought it might be too easy, and it said <laughs> Squee. And I was like, oh, then build me a Squee Panharmonicon deck. Yeah. We attack the, the Risk Study player. Thank you. Come on, Explorer That scope. makes sense. I still got I still got a land off it, so it's already already paid for itself. I'm just saying, and then we attack, <laughs> and give give me a rank explorer scope or any of the ramping sword. We have so many now, right? We have sword of the anime, we have yeah. the two real swords. Does yeah. explorer scope still make the cut in 2023? Yes, I eh. like it. But it's also gold eh. being pick and prying blade, which I actually run a decent amount too. I'm just gonna hand that. I feel it lost value after the second <laughs> sort of the end. <laughs> <laughs> I hate you do get to put so non-basics, much. though. So you could play a whole like non-basic deck. All right. I could play a two-drop, but I won't because then I can't pay the one. Done. Pass. Yeah, I just you thought of this so it's fine. insane <laughs> no play I could do, but then nope. I can't pay the one twice. Nope. So, oh, please. Man of my word. Uh, oh, if you don't pay the one, your your game plan's so slow, Phil, that uh, you're going to die of mana crypt. No, so <laughs> you the better problem accelerate is that, your game. Uh, Tails never fails. Correct. Tails. Uh, so that yeah. I would probably end up What's the that? enemy again, but obviously... Richard should be the enemy with his Ristic study, so I'm the consecrated just, uh, I should be the enemy. Tomer the has like a fully Voltron Fear Steel Paladin and a Maze of Myth over there. That's Plus true. an Eigenjo to protect yeah, and his I Pure Steel. A, I have a consecrated <laughs> Ooh, what is this again. one? Oh, see, this is how fast. Yeah. Like, oh no, he has a Sword of Fire and Ice, you guys. He's, he's drawing <laughs> an extra card per turn. He's going off the trains. And then it's like literally just consecrated Sphinx. It draws like eight turns per cycle. <laughs> well, I, I already it's spent like, resources the, dealing the, with the Sphinx. Degrees. Your turn. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, let's see what chat GPT comes up for. Okay, you, so you end of the battlefield, field, I lose life equal to its I mana value. So. so six life, but... I didn't yeah, really quick, I didn't really look over the the deck list that much, I'll be honest. I just made sure that Helm of Culture, Shield of Culture, and Sword of Culture in the deck. I, now <clears throat> now Phil won't pay the one. Oh <laughs> no, Phil, yeah, that's uh, Phil Phil's always been I, no, but he's, he's still but no, gonna pay the Phil's one. Still, I, still, still, I'm still man. drawing eight cards yeah. minimum, right? Yeah, I got enough cards if yeah. I survive. I'm just scared yeah, of Chris, Richards. Do I you're scared of my Ristic study when you have a Consecrated Sphinx. <laughs> Every time I draw one, you draw two. But that fills. sword is out of control, <laughs> you guys. You um, gotta, have, you gotta have swords for plowshares, right, Tomer? I don't think it Richard has infiltrated theme. the internet enough to get chat. <laughs> GPT did not play swords. All right, I'm gonna, I'm gonna look at my list. Um, it it like has secret swords, plowshares, and path got. to exile because it's a responsible <clears throat> okay. gamer. Okay, so there's are they there's in my hand though? Survey says no. <laughs> <laughs> oh wow! Yeah, you're drawing lots of cards. Phil actually paid drawing a lot. Yeah, I hate yeah, Ristic. I mean, I play it as well, but I didn't build this deck. But I hate Ristic study so much. <laughs> I'm just gonna pay the one over, out of spite. <laughs> I can't hit a land drop for the life of me. How much <laughs> does my commander cost? Eight. One, two, three, four, five, mm-hmm. six, seven. Well, it is very boring playing ChatGPT decks. It's just like staples. Mm-hmm. It is a little stable, eh? except my deck. <laughs> Your deck is—I uh, don't even know what's going on. I—I uh, I don't either, honestly. Maybe if it like is a blink deck, then Alpo Siege makes sense with Panorama. Oh, oh. okay. Rampaging. Sure. This was the ninety. This was the the, the last card because it that gave was... me an illegal deck. It, 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 I said a hundred. It gave me ninety nine. So I'm like. Add one card and it gave yeah. me rampaging Baylots. <laughs> sure. I have to admit that I made one card. So I had a. Once I had a finished list, it did add Cyclonic Rift. 
And then I told it, nah, and no, no, I have got it. <laughs> yeah, I, I kind of hated more than Rustic Studies, actually. Oh, my so, Ooh. goodness. Ooh. Yeah, Ooh. Burn at the stake. Can you cast it? Wait, you have no it, creatures. It zero. Never mind. Yeah. Yeah. Well, you're so, playing yeah. around the Sphinx, though. Good job. It's an exile. Yeah, it does play around the Sphinx. How do I uh, deal with this? Phil's at eight cards already. And he has a reliquary tower. Oh, it's I over. No. Yeah, Phil's. <laughs> a reliquary tower? Oh, oh boy. <laughs> and if Tomer yeah. hits him, Phil draws two. <laughs> or, I mean, no. Or he just you walks with the Delver. Having oh, having a Sphinx on the battlefield actually will make me pay the one. Even even for me, that's too much. <laughs> wow. I want to draw three cards but, but, is look, just too we much. We can actually mill him out. <laughs> hmm, <laughs> His natural wait, draws is, is plus the draws main? from Rhystic, we can mill him oh, out. <laughs> it's, it's not a May. It's a May. Oh, yeah, it's a May. Oh, it's a May. We can't mill him out. We cannot mill him out. This is not on the But he'll get greedy. I would get greedy. I'd rather die drawing my tie no, no, no. Hey, no. If, if, it, if it was a bus, would, would you would you would you would you entertain yes. the idea of milling him? I out? would. Oh, I love the mill him out plan. And actually, <laughs> there is a there's a video on. I don't think you saw it, Tomer. I was playing modern where I milled out someone with their own Esper Sentinel. Uh, so oh no, possible. I've seen it, and, and I, I heard the shout out. Somebody clipped it for me. Oh, did they send it to you? Okay, <laughs> yeah. I just wanted to make sure you saw. It. Yeah, so it, yeah, it, it is. Wonderful. It is a legit strategy. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, draw card. Draw card. I uh, yeah. I don't know. I don't know what I should do. Like I hate risk study with every fiber of my being, but I know that Phil's in a better <laughs> position right now. I mean, we got to hit me, right me Tomer. <laughs> this is clearly the way. It's got to be Phil. Like, but what if he's rampant? Rhystic studies drawn zero cards. Oh, Phil has drawn like six cards plus eat and removal. Uh, <laughs> and right. everyone's playing around. Plus the he's a blue deck. Phil is playing he's around the out. study. <laughs> Wait, what? When were the free spells made? Was it before or after Chat GPT was Ooh, traded? That's a good. That's a good question. We're gonna under twenty twenty. We're gonna hit Phil a little bit harder then. Hey. You, you could hit him and then Maze of it just hey. to say. Oh, sorry. Oh, 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 that's oh, a Calder it's a, it's, a, it's a sword. Uh, pay one. Mm. All right. Yep. Oh yeah, he can equip for free because he has a pure steel and a hammer and so on. I I asked ChatGPT Tomer if they know who uh, if it knew who you were, yeah. <laughs> and it said yes. You're well known for uh, your Commander Quarter series oh, <laughs> on MTG Goldfish. Yeah, <laughs> I'm afraid to ask if it knows me. <laughs> it no, did. It did know you though. Guys I asked content creators. I, yeah, I asked what it. some uh, what what kind of decks he played. What decks is Tomer knows most known for? And Edric was one of the ones that mentioned. So it must kind of okay. know who you are a little okay. bit. Edric, yeah. Talran, Cranko, and Eureka. It and it says you play you. budget decks. You like affordable, affordable decks. So it does kind of know you. Not accessible. <laughs> yeah, not accessible. Yeah, <laughs> affordable <laughs> while still fun. <laughs> but that could still just be Commander Quarters. Yeah, I guess that, that's true. <laughs> All right, we equip it. This is a big. What? Wait, if you. That's a big night. You just cast your just... commander and hit Phil. Does he die? <laughs> he does, right? Uh, no, because he has a blocker. But I'm yeah, if you remove the blocker, he's dead. <laughs> yeah. Oh, that gives. But it doesn't. No, the, my commander doesn't have haste. Yeah, yeah. I mean, but the... you need to be able to attack with it and have the oh, man cast it. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Ah, oh, explorer scope. Never lucky. Oh. Oh, it's going to pay off. It already it actually already oh. paid off. I've already it's already two mana ramp. What, what else can you need? And it's not I, metal craft. I actually think it's worth it if you're playing like pure steals and whatnot. Like if, if that's what your deck's doing, it's probably worth it. Like one mana to your pure steals. Would you play in a, another equipment deck, though? Like if you're not pure stealing or maybe you just always have. Every, pure every I think you need a pure steal. I think you need but it's not good enough without, deck. yeah, without synergy. All right. If it if that Phyrexian Delver didn't die to, to it, blocking, it would be Calder would have done something. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Imagine. Oh, wait. It doesn't exile it if it dies? <laughs> no. <laughs> no. <laughs> oh, boy. But okay. imagine, imagine if it was a bigger creature, though, but didn't die to combat. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, so imagine if it was a 12 12 or something. <laughs> yeah. Imagine if it was going Merit up. Lodge. This would take on Merit Lodge. That's how strong sort of call it is. Uh, Richard, pass. I think I'm going to stop paying the one. Uh, yeah. Hey, Ugh. I got something. Shocker. You mean every time you cast a spell, draw two is not powerful? <laughs> I got enough cards. Can, can you I... storm off, though? 
<laughs> he has some enough cards. Probably it's not. like we can beat him on mana, though. That's a thing. Tails? You can beat uh, him by just totally casting your commander and hoping <laughs> he gets there. <laughs> and hoping my commander lives for it. Look, commander yes. boots. He's dead, right? Now yeah. he's dead. He yeah. Double blocker. That, that would involve not paying the one, though. Are you are you willing to do that? No. <laughs> and then he draws two cards, and it's like a, a swords to plowshares or something. I said, people pay the one, I always pay the one. That's I'll go. I'll lose the I mean, game. Well, to do well that. Phil, well, Phil's not paying the one here. All all bets are off now. Oh, that's true. If Phil stops paying the one, does that mean I get to start? I'm desperate for a land no. drop. Actually, <laughs> I've been, I've wait, been trying to play no. more than we're four just, lands. This, this is this Richard's tactic to. This is a risk study tactic. It is. Be like, I'm not. I'm not the problem, you guys. You should just feed me infinite cards. Well, but isn't he not the problem now? Because Phil is literally drawing infinite I, cards. I mean, Phil is literally drawing infinite <laughs> cards. But then you have even two, if you pay the one. But okay, so <laughs> either either you have one person drawing infinite cards, or you have two people drawing infinite cards. If uh, uh, yeah, sorry, I can't pay that. Uh, how about he literally draw infinite cards? Wait, wait, oh no! Wait, no, wait. no, oh, no he's making me. blockers. Yeah, I am. Yeah. He's making blockers. Yeah. So right off replic- uh-huh. replication, create. What is going I, on? Oh, 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 oh is he I, gonna bolt oh, bend it or something? Wild ricocheting? No, no. I think it's chaos. It's warp. Panharmonicon's time to shine here. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> now he's gonna get a bunch of consecrated sphinxes. <laughs> oh no! Yeah, this is like that's sick. I'm. Oh wow. yeah, we're gonna we're gonna copy this writer replication a, a couple times. Oh, we... actually, yeah. I think I go infinite here because dual caster will double trigger this, and you can oh if you if you copy caster. the dual caster mage then yeah you go then i can yes. yeah. yeah so i think yes. i accidentally go infinite i think he, you, have infinite you can't win or do anything <sighs> no but he can un- if he if he gets to untap he wins the game with dual caster mage hmm. well sh- sh- show it through so you're copying oh, yeah. the writer so replication. dual caster mage is going to copy the writer replication i also have panharmonicon so i'm going to get double dual caster mage so, even better so yeah, the writer replication is on the stack why this is on the stack the dual caster is going to resolve, oh, yes. and I that have. is going to give me a kicked right of replication. I get to change the target of it, so I can target my dual caster mage, and now I'm going to get Ooh. five dual caster mages. The right of replication is still on the stack, so I can make a bunch of dual casters, but more importantly... Eventually, yeah, I can make okay. just like infinite consecrated sphinxes or rampaging bay loss. So, essentially, I think and rampaging bay loss. So you just and and pure steel paladin. So wait, if you and Phil have a sphinx, you can both draw your whole deck, right? As soon as I draw a card, is that yes. how that works? If we until someone says no, yeah, but we could. Yeah, if well, you didn't, the question so, is, do y'all have a wrath? No, the thing is, each other out. If you didn't have this <laughs> panamonicon, I would have. Been able to counter this, <laughs> but so I guess oh, you have Seth a actually effect? got that. Yeah, I got a swan song, so I could have countered the copy. Wow! But so I the guess the actually going to do it. Clutch Wait, after all. no, you could have stopped it. You could have no. countered your own right of application when he put both dual caster mage triggers on the stack. Oh yeah, you should have countered oh, yeah. your own right. Nah, I'm too yeah. greedy for this. Wait, can't you still do it now? <laughs> what do you mean you're too oh, greedy oh, for oh, this? Has the you lose the game. Yeah, at this point, I think it's a little. A now little it's past too the late. Point. But yeah, you could have just. Yeah, no, your I didn't own think right. about this, but I probably would have just ignored it just because I can't do that. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe Chad GPT but, but, but is you, a hidden you could deck just cast genius. back your right of replication later. <laughs> I. I gotta say, I'm kind of impressed with ChatGPT's deck building. When I saw 48 lands, like two ETB triggers, I was like, this is the worst Panharmonicon deck ever. But Seth, I have news for you. It's totally this is how paying all up. EDH games go when you play the staples. <laughs> <laughs> when you play the Battle Cruiser staples, it turns out like this. <laughs> no, I can play a one drop and maybe draw a Blasphemous Act if I play it. But you have I'm enough sure it's in the li- I have a land drop left. I have a land drop. There's one certain card I could draw into that I think would win me the game next turn in a very yeah, brutal way. Wait, a Even single card? Way, what? A single card. That would be kind of funny. I'm going to stop Yo. drawing. Okay, here right, we it's are. It's done. 
We, we we've got, I we're think back. the blasphemous we're act back. was hey. all the stuff that happened before this, honestly. All right. <laughs> it's, there's it's a lot of card like... drawing. And we finally it's almost got like to none it. of this happened. Yes. Like, from the viewer's lost, perspective, like, we've been here for an hour clicking I've okay. I've been trapped and... here, yeah. I feel like Gandalf, when he got resurrected, he's like, every every minute felt like many eternities. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that was... Oh, did I tell you I tried to watch the Lord of the Rings movies it. again this weekend? Oh, my oh. God. I made it through one and a half. One and a half. And I was proud of that. This is why we didn't get a a pre con this time. (laughs) I I never watch movies. I didn't make the movies. Man, the original trilogy is just. It's not a movie. That is just. It's an experience. It's an experience. (laughs) I remember coming home from Orlando, like from America to Germany, and somebody in a row in front of me watched Lord of the Rings first episodes in uh on an ipad and i watched just by looking over to him watched it with him and i got mm-hmm. goosebumps from all the cool scenes and so i i guess <laughs> i'm due for another watch party but it is long yeah it's like nine hours or something jeez I, I, we, yeah you can't though. do it in one sitting i feel like i feel like it would actually make the the movies worse if you do like the director's cut like the extended version all three of them because then you're just like suffering Nah. I think the best way is you like each movie, each movie you watch extended, uh, but then you maybe put like an intermission in the middle, like like take a break, take a snack and stuff, and then don't watch more than one movie at a day. I, in a day, I think that would be so. Last time I watched them, I was All on right. holiday. So oh, yeah. right. Wow, sure. there we go. Oh, I that built is three no, cards that is for the ETPs or tax, and then wow. I get zombies when creatures go in. Are milled, yeah. That's pretty good with your command, actually. Yeah. Mm-hmm. mm-hmm. Damn. Yeah. All right. What did I mill? I milled. You have my elders, vampiric tutor, and island. And you got oh, okay. one creature, so one zombie. Not bad. Um. And then I guess we. There's a giant sorted creature. Okay. Mm-hmm. Uh, I cast a Sylvan Library. Yep. And pass the turn. Some more card draw. Here's a card. Here's All a good right. old. 20 what what is chat GPT stop trading 2019 2016 yeah. <laughs> 20 something like that 2020 2021 i think yeah, all I right seth you have 50 what the, cards what the all right <laughs> just end the turn. most of them don't do anything but we're gonna did we're you gonna draw reliquary a tower because it'd be very sad if you didn't <laughs> i did i did draw until i found the reliquary tower so that's good at least beyond that then we all do not know what i'm doing here you should wheel right after oh this. i forgot okay oh, oh a wheel geez. would be great <laughs> But what if he plays uh, not for, Sphinx Wheel? Not for me. <laughs> <laughs> Good, whatever. I have like 50 Dover, cards play in play white wheels. Wheel. Okay. <laughs> All right. Show me the obscure check that, <laughs> that chat GBT pulled up. <laughs> Watch pass. Seth play this mountain right. for value and forget to play Reliquary Tower. <laughs> All right, Reliquary oh, Tower on the battlefield. <laughs> we uh, did it. He saw the line. Okay, so first Reliquary Tower. Second, yeah. oh, this huge hand. Activate uh, Sundial of the Infinite. Second, we're gonna don't forget play. to use all your activated abilities. Wait, if you activate yeah. Sundial of the Infant, do you skip the discard phase and then you get to hold on to all the cards? I I am totally giving sure. up on this. Pay the one so. thing. I, I have fifty cards up. in hand. I did. It happens. Wow. So, sorry, Tomer. Remember who's not paying the one, Tomer. <laughs> yeah, it says in the reminder. I mean, Phil also didn't pay the one, but at least he had a good. But reason. he had a perfect. He needed to draw. He had a purpose. That, that my way. reason is I have 50 cards in hand. Richard's not going to outdraw me at this point, even if uh, I. Are you sure? By the time it gets back around here, I might have 50 cards as well. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Yeah, that is that is kind of true. So uh, we're going to have some mana. Are you storming off? Well, that's that's five no, colors. That's going on. I don't think I can really win. Maybe. No, I don't you think so. You have Panamonicon, though. Mm-hmm. Yeah, but my deck doesn't actually do that much with panharmonicon uh we're gonna play a gauntlet of power to make a little more mana oh Ooh, yeah we're we're That's gonna scary. choose a red please pay the yeah. one with the red come on it doesn't, mm, it doesn't oh, no, you, you, mana, need a, you need all your Phil, you have 21 mana. cards in hand too <laughs> can i always yes somehow to don't be study? greedy i could have had so <laughs> um, much more if i, I wouldn't have crashed a <laughs> moto yeah me too i could have also drawn more uh okay so we do that yeah then i'm and not then... one anymore <laughs> overload of vandal blast uh-oh oh. gg uh-oh get rid of some of these uh artif- artifacts uh-oh. hanging yeah, out i'm I wanted out to do oh, this okay. 
Uh oh. Mm-hmm. Oh, Phil wanted to. <laughs> yeah, I saw okay, the right? Wait, so yeah, Force of Will? T- no, last turn <laughs> I I had the option to Vandal Blast, and instead I. Oh, did that means you. St- whatever. That happened means you still time. have the option to Vandal Blast. I still got it, but I think. Oh, yeah, I might you just. You get that as yeah. for revenge. Yeah. <laughs> I am so out of this game. Well, Tomer, now you look <laughs> really out of it. Yeah. <laughs> but you have a maze of it. <laughs> Great. Wait, no, you can yeah. SRAM and just pop off with artifacts. You can rebuild. Like... Phil literally just said he has a Vandal Blast in his hand. I do. Yeah, but he'll let you yeah. rebuild. <laughs> oh, I'm, so I'm going to cast it because of yeah. Seth, not because of you. So Th- Then you cast That's Second right. Sunrise oh, or whatever. Oh, boy, no, it's a Perfrost. See, that Perfrose. is uh, it just a... Mm. That looks with Panamonicon. Oh. It does, which is about to be blown up, but still. Uh, Are we going to die? Perforos. Not, no. Not yet. No, no, no. <laughs> Not yet. <laughs> I mean, right. someday. So, so this yeah. actually helps, because Phil only has eight mana to use his 21 cards. Yeah. And then and then he will Vandal Blast, and Seth will go down to eight mana as well. That is that is the thing. If, if and then we mill him out in... by staxing them, Tomer. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Wait, if somebody's Seth, winning on sense. card advantage, you have it to stop sense. them on mana it, advantage. If they're winning on mana would, advantage, you have to stop them on work. card advantage. But if they have both, then you just GG, basically. Oh. All right. So I get a bunch of bunch of things that deal damage if I ever have a creature come into it, play. Which so what's that? So if he draws enough cards, he, he probably has like something where it's like discard X cards, make tokens or something. Wait, ooh, maybe that's I good. wish. Lands. Right, one, two, I need you three, to storm off four, with, five, with six, Cheerios. Seven, eight, seven, eight, seven, <laughs> Richard is getting up there with card draw. I told Man, you, Ristic by the time he gets back to me, busted. I've drawn 50 cards and caught up to you yeah, guys. That's, Ristic <laughs> I need Tober to cast five busted. enchant equipment in a row mm-hmm. right here. Uh-oh. I'm not, uh, I'm, are you the paying the one? Out. What is, oh, I literally just got board wiped, <laughs> Richard. Come on, Boo. settle down. Settle down. Hey, no, just, I'm not paying Are you going to pay the one, Tober? Are you going to pay the one? Wait, not paying the one. You're all the worst. You're all the worst people. You're all the worst people. One, two, three. Um, How can you not pay the one? You're all the worst people. Um, Do you have enough indestructible artifacts to play the the together here? I'm paying the one. I, I'm not even playing. I don't have indestructible artifacts, actually. Wait, did you pay the one? Wow. So yes, I'm paying the one for this because I, I know exactly what my next turn is or my next uh, spell is. Oh. So who's He's winning totally the game so at this point? Assuming, assuming I mean, Phil Vandal Blast. No, no, you're you're gonna you're gonna draw a card, but oh, I am? you're not gonna draw two cards. Three mana. What is this? The Danatha. <laughs> this Maze of it is looking very awkward. Oh. I know, right? <laughs> this is why I never run Maze of it in my decks. Uh, Danatha, uh, first strike vigilance life link, or is an equipment spells you cast cost one less to cast. So far, your That's deck it. looks like a decent e- equipment deck. I'm yep. kind of impressed. Mm-hmm. I wish I had a Consecrated Sphinx, but it's fine. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Don't we all? <laughs> all right. <laughs> uh, pass. I'm not oh, wait, no, I can hit last. somebody. I- I'm definitely going to hit somebody. I like, I like our clock sets at 30 minutes from resolving triggers. <laughs> oh, my 50. God, that turn. <laughs> Tomer's at yeah, 45. Phil's at 35. He had less triggers to go through. Yeah. <laughs> 10 Sphinxes is, is too much. We send a message. We send a message to at Seth. Mm. Oh, are right. gonna die? Is Seth going to untap and make tokens and kill us all? Yeah. How about no Vandal Blast, Phil? Well. Yeah, so if I don't sure Vandal Blast here, on. is there any way that everybody well, else so dies before me? But then I'm like, like no, I can't deal with Purphoros and... Uh, yes. Impact Tremors yeah, but anyways. you're 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 how ha- halving his more than halving his mana. So whatever he's going to do next turn, oh yeah, it's going to be far less but, effective. But that's kind of taking it, his whole. It's taking turn. my turn though, he could be doing and then I can things. be just punched. To okay, death, but anyways. but if 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 the option is lose or to you guys, be a little bit slower, or lose to Panharmonicon, I choose to yeah. lose to Panharmonicon. Yeah. <laughs> right. lose to do what you want. You're going to get a little on top of Gauntlet we and can be Panharmonicon. Friends. I've got, can be friends, I've got seven damage on the board. I'm definitely going to kill you. Mm. They're Sorry. not going to kill you, Phil. Don't worry about of that. Of course I'm not going to kill you, but Seth will. Oh, no. We can be Panharmonicon buddies. 
Can oh, ChatGPT play some rituals while we're at it? Why, why do I play cemetery? <laughs> who, who plays rituals? <laughs> Just with Jessica's will. Imagine Jessica's will with oh, Jessica's will. Ooh. That's too new. <laughs> oh my god, you would oh make god. so much mana. Isn't this so refreshing though? We're just playing with boomer cards. Even no, though they're very yeah, it, is. It, it took it, like eight mana to cast them as opposed to two mana. I don't know. Like since we played, <laughs> it uh, says the Ristic Study player. But ignore that card for a second. Everything else is pretty. Well since we played, I'm literally the, the only age, person kinda, here playing fair magic. I kind of prefer new cards in the mix as well. Like old magic is just staples and boring combos. Honestly, like new magic is also boring combos. But at least you have super specific, super niche cards. When we played pre-EDH, it was all like, oh, look who has the consecrated Sphinx or something. <laughs> kind of not too yeah. cool. <laughs> just like this game. <laughs> I think, yeah, because I think we kind of You play theme the decks, it's just yeah, you can, less but you, on the you, nose. Yeah. These days, it's like, oh, this this is a commander, and it says when you play an equipment, you draw a card. Wow, I wonder what I'm going to build around yeah, true. this one. Yeah. And then but, every single every single commander deck looks the exact same because the commander tells you what cards to put in it. Oh yeah, every deck of this commander, yeah, yeah, that's true. Not entirely true with all commanders, but yeah, I, no. I mean, I criticize this as well, so I'm not gonna say that's not true. If you guys attack me for this turn cycle, I'm gonna be okay. You guys don't attack me. Creatures. Oh wait, no, we do have creatures. You do I'll have creatures. You, I'll, give a, I'll give you a full turn cycle of non attack. I won't hit you. Ah, oh, Phil. I'm sorry, you really Seth. Want to I'll anger get the two, the Perforos player. Two gel- okay. I check Perforos targets everybody. I don't. I don't <laughs> <laughs> How do we get rid of Perforos though? Yeah, I don't know. I uh, can't. <laughs> I play. Really scared, I need life break. I'm really scared of Perforos. Draw me cards. <laughs> oh, Seth loses. End the turn, Seth. Yeah, I kind of wanted that mana. Kind of wanted that mana. There's one mana right there, untapped. Why does it does it always ask me twice if I want to pay for this? It really wants. It's, it really wants to be a responsible really? gamer. Being a responsible gamer. Are you sure you don't want to be a responsible gamer? Oh, so he's holding up interaction. I guess yes. he's got swan song. We remember that he said that before. Yeah. I'm pretty sure oh, he's got okay. swan song. Yeah, I should stop saying yeah. which guy. Kind of <laughs> 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 yeah. no, that doesn't matter to me. My mana. I'm sorry, uh, Seth. Right, Phil, we well, had our fun. I mean, you. you're welcome yeah, for this. We had our fun. You have cards. still has 19 cards in hand. Seth has 45 cards in hand. I think the fun is still going. Honestly, most of them are lands, but... <laughs> I would imagine. Yeah, I would <laughs> imagine if you play <laughs> 43 lands or something. 40, 48. Yeah. <laughs> wow, 48 lands. Wow, so that... Right. So I use Sylvan Library's ability. Good thing <laughs> Conspirated Sphinx isn't on the battlefield. You're actually going to uh, take eight? Take eight. No, I'm not taking eight. Take eight. <laughs> In the face. All the way, the Richard. Us. <laughs> no fear. No fear. Yeah. yeah. Go for it. Put on top. The weird part is I told ChatGPT do 36 lands at least, and it did 35. I still hit all my hand <laughs> jobs, but still. Yeah, I did 37, <laughs> and it gave me 35. Over yeah, and over it can't again, count, and really. Like, yeah. <laughs> okay, I have something really funny, Tomer. Do you want to see it? Does it does it make me more sad than I already am, Richard? No, but it gives us justice. Oh, Do you okay. want justice? I want justice. <laughs> Please don't wipe my creatures. Back to basics. Seth, I think you'll appreciate mm-hmm. this play. I I want to see are it. You, are you? Is it a Panormonicon? Windfall. Oh God. Oh Windfall. no. <laughs> what if, what if it's Narset Wheel? <laughs> Can you imagine? <laughs> Yeah. What if it's Narset I... Wheel, guys? No, but if you if you if you actually win, if it was literally Windfall, it would kill Seth. He would draw his deck. Yes. Yeah, I think it would mill out, wouldn't they? They'd mill out. <laughs> that would be the ultimate justice. Oh my god, I do play I, Windfall. I, look, okay, so I'm I'm, I'm gonna activate to DC. Did I brick? I brick because I need two of the cards. Okay, I should have right. seen that uh-huh. coming. I mean, those Perfect. are. S- I don't know if I should be scared or not. Mind slicer. Oh, you're gonna you're, you're gonna oh, be oh, so bad. Is it mind slicer. I'm gonna be so mad. You're gonna oh, be no. so bad. If yeah. I can count, mind and read. slicer would be disgusting. Yes, true. Are we discard their hand? Yes. Oh, that would be that so would put, brutal. Feel don't, a decent don't do that. <laughs> All right. So we we deals we deal the team, damage. Team mind slicer yeah. right now. Take the five. Everybody discard their hand. No. Okay. We already play one and a half hours. Play honest <laughs> magic. Play an honest magic. Are you getting rid of my Perforos? What? What if I cast Terastodon? Oh. Oh, 
God. And Ugh. what if I choose per- purpose three non creature indestructible? Just oh, get with that. It. Get the reliquary tower. What if towers. I get reliquary get tower reliquary from towers. Saffron <laughs> Olive? What if I get reliquary tower from Brewer's Kitchen? Yeah, no, I don't like that. Uh, what's, what's, the last, no. what's the last thing that I kill? I think you get the outpost siege. Oh, no, the outpost siege. Or impact tremors, well. actually. Impact tremors. I think we get the tremors. Yeah. Oh, yes. so is that funny? Oh, is this funny? No, <laughs> I'm not sure if that yes, is funny. I like this. I like so, this. I think this is kind of funny. So yeah, bad. I'm sure it's not funny. Oh, Tomer, okay. do you, you agree got, with me that it's funny? You still got to draw a billion cards, all right? And you get to yeah, keep but now seven. I got to discard a billion cards. Aww. Mm. Good. I think this Good. is kind of funny. Nah, this is that's sure it's not. Though. Yeah, I'm. I'm sure you're. And it's green. It. It's a green creature. Oh no, oh. we're getting pink. Oh no, we get peripherals pings. Okay, so. Are we dead still? So, Phil, no. um, yes. I know you got that swan song. I do. If oh, I play that. something that is not really going to do and do it, it's not going to kill you, but yeah, it's going no. to kill the other two players. Yeah, are you are you interested in letting that resolve? Know, is this sure. some okay. discard, discard card thing? Oh, baby. Wait, uh, let me see the card first before I say it's, it's, it's a it's a very it's a very old card. I don't think I don't think you're going to be. I mean, I don't think you're going to be that scared of it. Mm-hmm. <laughs> It just okay. one shots me and Richard. Not that scary though. Basically, what? <laughs> essentially, it does just one shot you too. What? Oh no! What is this? <laughs> you better swan song it, Phil. Yeah, you better swan song. <laughs> yeah, All right, I gotta discard sure the I, hand the size he- here. The hero we needed. Can uh, I? Okay. Hmm. I think I'm done discarding. My motive's just lagging. I remember when turn four I was the scary one. Yeah. Good times. <laughs> All right, outpost times. these triggers. I'll hold on to my, those memories. Ugh. <sighs> Well, I just want to see them discard. I like, God, yeah. At least, at least if we have I to am die, very disappointed we have to in that. The hand size and play honest okay. Magic. Is there a way we can do? All right, we draw another. How lane, can you kill both me and Tomer? Yeah, like, not me. Six mana. He has forty six. But not Phil. So, so it has to be like targeted. Maybe he casts like inner fire and he makes mana equal to uh, the number of cards in hand. And then he like maybe he casts storms. price of progress. No, that would like nuke. Okay, I don't so think, I don't think <laughs> it, but inner fire. Maybe it's mana geyser. He like mana geyser. No. Oh, oh, he, oh, oh, yeah. He probably has mana geyser. Oh, he, mana geyser would be sweet. Oh, oh yeah. Side, All right. Side, I'm gonna play Nykthos. Nykthos doesn't do anything yet. Oops. Seth, it was an accident. I didn't mean to hit the button. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Eight, I thought nine. it was. I thought it was Phil's. It was an accident. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I guess I can actually. I don't want to do this, but I could chaos, <laughs> chaos warp Phil's land to make sure he doesn't swan song me. Oh, wait, why? Hmm. What? Why don't you just do that <laughs> to make sure? <laughs> Because you're probably killing him right after you kill us, though. No? I mean, he's no, not. No, no. This doesn't immediately impact him. I mean, I guess it hurts. Let me make sure I'm reading my own cards correctly. Yeah. <laughs> what, is this? what is this? Yeah, it is. Loud, it so. is. I am so reading intrigued. it correctly. All right, so Ask we're gonna Chat GPT. Yeah. <laughs> Chat GPT. Should I? All right, we're gonna we're gonna do the chaos work play. No. Oh. Let's see. This is why Seth can't be trusted. So. Chaos Phil, warp. You float, float that man. I mean, if uh, why? How did two are you not going to counter it? I mean, I'm okay. So you're asking. I, he's probably going to counter it. I will tell you what I have. It's the card I have is repercussion. What is Three mana enchantment. Uh, when a creature is dealt damage, it deals that much damage to that creature's controller. And then you're going to blasphemous act. Oh, he's going to blasphemous oh. act. And then I may have a blasphemous act. Yeah, hell yeah. No, I'm not going to count on that at all. You're actually. okay with those being. Oh, okay. Cool. If you're okay with that resolving, I will not chaos warp your land then. Uh, all right. Well, we'll go no, that direction. So he uses the chaos warp. <laughs> so repercussion. Yeah. I mean, this also hurts me a lot too because I have two creatures. And I'm a creature that damage. Oh, yeah. So oh, I'm taking yeah. 26. Tomer and Richard are dying. Well, you can Phil's just counter taking. the repercussion. No, counter the blasphemous song. act. No, I'm just going to kill my creature in response so I don't take the damage. Oh. oh. Wow, I thought you were going to hit my face and that would have ruined all of this. Well, you should have just killed him, no? I could do it. Yeah, that would have killed him. Lightning bolt to Seth's face would kill him. Yeah, you could have well, waited until Blasphemous Act. I could have yes. not cast the Blasphemous Act. No, 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 you waited until Blasphemous Act happened. Yeah, you should have waited to kill him. Hey, I got my time. I got to take a Lightning bolt would have served a purpose in Commander for the first time ever. You would have won the game in an amazing style. Oh, Phil. Hey, at least I don't get the damage, okay? 
Oh my god, I'm going to be screaming right now. Comment section well, now. I'm sorry. Oh my goodness, I'm he didn't count your own writer publication. Oh my god. I'm going to read the comments, huh? How about that? <laughs> we will not pay the we will not pay the one. Wow, that would have been so good. Wait, so what oh, stops me from so just brutal. flashing back my it? With that would, Phil would have just won. Like, yeah, I would have just won on the spot right there. Yeah, with, no, yeah, <laughs> with nothing else, right? That would have been like Wait, maybe you guys been have YouTube dead, shorts. Oh, that would have been amazing. Yeah. Tomer is Tomer oh, dead? Yeah. No, Tomer, no, Tomer is exactly dead. I'm dead. That is exactly. Seth would oh, take twenty six plus three. Yeah. He'd, he'd be dead. Well, I just yeah, missed won. the perfect. That would have been, and then Seth would have dealt the killing blow to everyone himself. Yeah, perfect. Yeah, is there? Is there? How do we edit? How do we edit it? Yeah, how do we? How do yeah. I avoid dying to the lightning bolt in the graveyard? Though? Yeah, I mean, I can, there, I, I can still feel pretty good about maybe, this. But maybe you don't the Then, then don't do this, and we'll kill Phil for you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, at this point, I think I'm I'm committed. You want second place? place? This is a second wait, how many? Play. Wait, if you're, oh, wait. But then you're, you're One, committing two, to just three, die on your on Four, five, turn? six, seven, eight. Mm. How you much do this, and I don't flashback. No. Can you even blast Oh, wait. Wait, wait, wait. I think I can. I think I can do it. I think I actually can uh-huh. do it and not die to lightning bolt because I can play Goblin oh, US. I'm sorry. It's Goblin, Goblin Bombardment. Oh, well. Uh, now, yeah, you don't die. Now you so don't now die I can sack a creature. Uh, we are not paying for the we're not paying for the one. So, God, viewers, let's, let's imagine <laughs> Seth played around it. All this free card draw. Seth played around it, and I never had the chance to do this, okay? So... Mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah, we will never speak of that again. We'll edit <clears> that, <throat> don't worry. <laughs> oh my god, that would have been the photo finish. <laughs> oh my god. No. Uh, lightning Bolt, I can't believe they put light... Is Lightning Bolt good in cast? Oh, that turns on Perforos? Probably, oh, yeah. I mean, is Godzies good, good in cast? Did you kill Phil? That's awkward. I think Lightning Bolt's fine. In Phil doesn't have any creatures, though. No, but you can oh, hit him for 12 with three. Perforos, yeah. Four. Yeah, so you can hit him. Wait, now you have to turn on Perforos. Oh, you get hit. Yeah, okay. Oh, I think I punted now, too, because I floated my mana. So I have to do it now so I can't attack Phil for 12. One, two, three, four, five, six. I, oh, we're doing it. We're doing <laughs> it. We're definitely doing it. We can ping Phil for one. Eh, eh. Sure. That's almost as good. Sure. Yeah. <laughs> uh, ping one, two, three, seven. Okay, we still have enough mana. Do this. Ping, ping. So we don't take so much damage. Now we blasphemous act. You still, you still I take thirteen it's, no, it's from Perforos okay. now. Okay. So I take thirteen. Right. Tomer right. takes one time. thirty-nine. Yep. Give me. Give me two okay, days. We're, we're gonna we're gonna pay two the days. one. <laughs> oh, I mean, if you're just the one, one and time, we're gonna pay the one. <laughs> Draw the days. Dang. <laughs> Does Chat GPT play wow. days? Oh, the yes. one time that Seth pays the one. Wow, repercussion <laughs> blessing was active. Oh, insane. Boom, 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 boom. Hilariously, man, maybe Chat GPT is good at this. Hilariously, the <laughs> Sundial the Infinite. I could have stacked the triggers in a way where I took zero damage if it was still around. How smart the look! How smart. It, yeah, it, maybe it I thought it was just. I thought it was <laughs> yeah. an idiot, but maybe this deck is just <laughs> so far above my comprehension. Human, it's you are like the, the greatest. <laughs> Get out! It's here. the greatest. Yeah, it's the greatest so commander deck of all time, and my human brain can't comprehend it. We need ChatGPT to make the deck and then also pilot the deck. Yes, that's, yeah. the, <laughs> next, that's the next episode. Of Once an AI episode. can we just play here. Play magic. Oh, geez, Richard. So right, once yeah, an AI can play I'm magic and too. try out millions of games in a second, then that would be pretty. Then it could do combos yeah. and stuff. But uh, I this... don't know though. What about Sparky? We already have magic AI. <laughs> <laughs> magic AI, <laughs> and it's not that intimidating. <laughs> oh my god, I can't believe. Right. Uh, I'll give it. I'm not I... giving it to the Rustic Study Player. I'll don't give, give it to. It... Don't give it to me. That pun oh, yeah, will haunt me in my dreams. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. I'm not going to give it to the Re- consecrated Sphinx either. Yeah, that's, Reward that's me fine. for paying the one a few times, Tomer. I really did. I wish I could give none of you. There was the, there was, was ones paid. Wow, what a grinch. <laughs> <laughs> we didn't give out a free you didn't, point. You didn't pay the one. You went crazy with consecrated Sphinx. No. <laughs> Oh, Ooh, Seth has, right. still has to discard to hands. So oh, yeah, that's that's coming for you too. Uh, don't worry. 
Oh, I actually know because of weird old so wording. Just like cyclonic riffs, and then you don't you don't have to go. discard. Oh no! Oh, it doesn't have cyclonic riff, yeah. within his deck. I don't play cyclonic. Oh, yeah. That's so, the one thing. Uh, yeah, the one thing <laughs> I said. Okay, it. I have limits. ChatGPT. Okay, did we did we do it? One, two, three, Wait, four, it. five, six, mm-hmm. seven, oh, eight. Okay. Yeah, you discarded. Discard. Discard. Successfully because, discard. Oh. That's that's last discard. <laughs> okay, so luckily, yeah. oh, well, it was mostly this. lands. Yakmos right, will so, oh, first line of text. You get to get back the relic. You may play tower. land cards oh, from your graveyard. Let's oh, get this relic oh, tower. Oh. I'm never gonna discard. I mean, uh, I don't know if Phil can win. Do, he has to no. deal with Seth pretty quickly. Seth has Perforos. Yeah, it doesn't yes. really matter. Mm-hmm. Yeah, Perforos is a clock. Oh, Six, on. seven, eight, nine. He's so gotta have it. He has gonna... 18 cards in hand. He's gotta have an answer to Perforos. Yeah, 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 I do. It's uh, indestructible, do though. Yeah, that's yeah. that's excited first, so. Let's do this. We just did the cleanest lightning bolt in the history of magic. Yeah, it could have yeah, been perfect. I, I hate it. I don't want to think about it. Um, then I can you just cast just gonna... mana to flip it again? Yeah. And then it was he exiled Perforos. That's a different thing. Oh, yeah, oh, oh it manifests a new card. Yeah, it's not. Just... It's not Perforos yeah, yeah. anymore. It's something else. How well, do we kill Phil? Back at it again. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, again. You and Why? me and the consecrated sinks. Can we win the game <laughs> instead of drawing more cards? Eventually. I told you I don't really have win conditions. I was kind of hyped for <laughs> having this uh, right of replication, but this go- went so wrong. <laughs> okay. It's not not as good with just one opponent, Wait, though. should you just like, write a replicate? Oh, Perforos is legendary. Never mind. <laughs> Oh, wait, what if... No, okay. Wait, if I got enough to trigger Devotion, oh, they you, would have triggered off each other. So if I had... If I made five, five which I would 10 have, damage, right? I could have done ten. And then wait, you need to flash in the creature or something. Scary. You can't. Hmm. Actually, oh, wait. I think Seth's yeah, got this. Let's see if the aggro player can close it out. Can we close it out? Actually, no. Seth's like only depends. at 16. So that's not really yes. an aggro player either. This is both right, like gonna... foreign territory for both of these players. <laughs> yeah. Like, yeah his, how do I draw more first. cards? <laughs> his deck is yeah. aggro. Wait, what, what's his I... commander? It's Squee. Uh, never mind. No. Yeah, Squee. Squee's, <laughs> yeah, squeeze squeeze aggro. Anything. It's recursive. It's, I don't it's know, good. I'm, I'm hey, favoring squeeze. Kess it... in this situation just because Kess has a lot more value here. I mean, we also has a Sphinx on board already and like yeah. triple sets. Yeah, mana. I guess Kess is kind of redundant here because you have like, you're drawing so many cards. Yep. Okay. Hmm. Get him down to three life and then cast lightning bolts again. There's nothing even that interesting. <laughs> you, gotta, in that. you gotta fix lightning bolts. So bolt. Phil's at 18. Mm hmm. <sighs> Boy. So close. Um, oh, he has a Nick, though. We do have a Nick, though. So we're trying We're trying to keep up on mana, sort of. Um, yeah, yeah, mana. This doesn't do a ton, but let's play. Felden, which Yo. I have for some reason. Sure. Okay, Felden. And then... <laughs> oh my god, this lightning bolt. Mindstone. <laughs> okay, these are not the haymakers. <laughs> no, <laughs> no, we were no not exactly. Not Setting exactly. up for the next turn. <laughs> discard it down to seven. And then... and you kept... Yeah, you discarded down to seven, kept Mindstone, Felden. This is not looking good. <laughs> <laughs> And then let's play Stalking Vengeance. Whoa, whenever another creature oh, okay, dies, okay. Here we go. damage equal to its power to do. And then you cast like Ball Lightning or something and then just hit him. <laughs> oh, Ball Lightning would be so good. Ball Lightning. Yeah, this is just like, yeah, this ChatGPT is just stuck in like 2018 or something. So we're going to... Swing it fit. Not that this card would see that much play even in 2018, but I remember this card being played a little bit in like 2012. I mean, it deals it damage cool, to me. Yeah. Either Look at way. This relevant body, a 5 5 versus the 4 6. <laughs> yeah, that's. So that's Phil's a, gonna. Wait, is that a 2 2 block. 1 1? What is this? Oh, yeah. Okay. It's a 2 it's 2. The manifest a 2 2, yeah. Yeah, it looked weird for me in there. Uh, so I take 7. Down to 11. Mm, mm, mm. Man, but this... Seth takes damage, too. I also take damage, yeah. 
Should yeah, unless he that, sacrifices yeah. it. You know what? If you chose dragons, would you have won? Pro- yeah, probably. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I mean, you would have made I so mean, many yeah. That was so long ago. How would I? It's yeah, hard to as soon as hard you to go with that. Dual casters, you would just win, right? Oh, that. But nice yeah, one. it would have would have won with the blasphemous act. Oh yeah, that's true. Oh, oh boy, no. I'm actually so close to lethal, but not yeah, cool. it's very close. Very close to lethal, actually. Actually, do I five, six, seven, eight? I think I hit show one. Oh my god! Oh. And the problem is, how oh. did you? I oh, no. All right. I wow, this pass. goblin bombardment is insanely good <laughs> on your part yeah, right now. Doing, Otherwise, I could some work. probably kill you. Oh, <laughs> all right. Well, let's see what Phil's got. Oh, I'm not miscounting, right? So this would be so this hits for five plus six, seven. <laughs> yeah, just short. Seven, eight, nine. Wow, yes, yeah, so close. <laughs> if yeah, I did have the outpost nine, siege set on on dragons. <laughs> All right, Phil. What does Phil have in the graveyard for Cass? Oh, he has a tutor. I mean, I could just yeah, do the blasphemous Actually, act thing. Didn't you didn't you just kill Phil if you let if you didn't sacrifice the the blocked creature? Mm, it got in for the same amount of damage, right? I think. Wasn't it blocked by consecrated swings or no? The two two, the manifest was blocked. Yes. Yeah. So, but did I cost myself damage? If you let the consecrated swing, stuff. if you let the the two two do the damage to the consecrated swing, it would have been two damage. It would have got. It would have hit for two. Yeah. Oh, of, maybe it would have. Yeah, because I hit for one and instead. That would have been exactoties. That wow, you're right. That would have actually mattered. Um, look at me being the my armchair now critic. Is the this question. Game. <laughs> yeah. I mean, I, I deserve, to don't deserve. To win, Tip yeah. tapping away. <laughs> yeah, we gotta. So we sack this ping. You. Yeah. I don't think we can let you copy this. the stalking vengeance. Yeah, that was. Mm. Wait, you let me do that? No, no, I can't let you do that. I think I no. die if I let you copy no, it. No, no, no. Just let it happen, though. <laughs> no, that so was kind of my only I think Seth's got it anyway. I, I think so was... too. Maybe. All right, and then yeah, so I think it would have been exactly one more damage. Yeah, I was thinking I need to sack it because I was gonna have to take four because of the because of the Sphinx stealing damage to the manifest. Wait, I, and I was, afraid that I was gonna die. Diesel, though. He's so set, if Seth, if Seth uh, Goblin Barman after on his turn, he would have taken Phil to one. But oh no, actually, wait, I think we're both idiots, Domer. No. Why? Because Docking Vengeance doesn't yeah, trigger vengeance on doesn't itself. Count itself. I was thinking oh, it, it does. Oh, I, I thought, thought I had five more oh, damage yeah, yeah, there, yeah. but no. So I think we'll yeah. another creature. Oh, okay. yeah, I was. Yeah, I, I so totally much. missed that too. Yeah, I thought it was every creature. Well, that, that me, me, as well. that does <laughs> that, make it a little that worse. That is pretty dead. Right dead. Am I? I mean, Phil can draw a lot of cards, but can he kill me? You have to kill him next turn exactly. Yeah, I thought so. I, I don't think Seth has it anymore. Hey, Maybe that last know, turn was the best hand. you could muster up. I don't know. And I got a good one. Dark Mage. Okay, okay, okay. Well, that's going to make my Chaos Warp worse. Fence is up. Um, he could have also just cast Mystical Tutor and then countered whatever you played. I mean, it, Mystical Tutor goes on the top. Oh, yeah, I do draw. Yeah, but you, two, oh, yeah, never mind. Oh, you got the Sphinx, yeah. yeah. I mean, I had. So like now you play a creature to get under Glenelendra? All right, Outpost Siege. <laughs> Give me something good. I mean, I do have the Squee in my great. Wait. Oh. This deck is brilliant. Squee Stalking Vengeance. <laughs> yeah, <I'm a> bombardment. <laughs> yeah. If I could have untapped with that, I would have just burned him out with the Squee just... casting it a bunch yeah, of times. The Squee beats. <laughs> the Squee burn. Chat GPT. Genius we're we're letting building. we're letting down Chat GPT at this. Yeah, point. it's, it's the, the AI brilliance. is so disappointed. Yeah. <laughs> I did for sure let down. Like it. <laughs> if you play Lightning Bolt, come on, keep it for the glorious play to shoot your opponent. Chat GPT knew. Yeah, they, they it knew it could foresee how this game was going to go, <sighs> and it put that bolt there just for that kill. It's rain all and, the simulations. <laughs> yeah. knows every yeah. the most <laughs> optimal outcome every single time. Oh man. 
<laughs> well, it's gonna be the next time you ask him. It's like we know what your account for is. So I'll yeah, give you rat gonna colony gonna and thrumming stuff. Yeah. <laughs> I won't. Yeah, there's, there's no way you can mess this one up, right? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay, excellent account. Let's see yeah. what it is. Uh, post siege. What, what it do we be, find? Uh, it's a mountain. Ooh, uh, okay, just fireball him for six. Oh no, you can't. Uh, it can be I actually, I actually have comet storm, but it doesn't. Yeah, resolve through the Dang. Glenolendra. You you need the one that can't be countered. There's some yeah, red ones. Uh, Dane fire, Dane fire. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, I do draw two. And draw. Yeah, Phil's got all the cards. Two more. Ooh. Okay. This makes sense with my commander. My god. Wait, does it? Is there yes. a, is there any way of is there any way of doing this? I guess the question is how many counters does Phil have? Literally two so on board. <laughs> well, <laughs> how many counters does he have that can counter creatures? I guess well, it's the 21 question. cards in hand. He does have many. He, he probably has some, given that many his cards. deck is cast staples. <laughs> he probably yeah. has at least counter spell and arcade denials. It's not even like cast. Wait, he never like used the swan song, for right? cast. It's just swan song We know period. there's a swan song. Yeah. Swan song. There's probably a mana drain and a, and a fierce guardianship and a force of will because it's just popular. How do you feel about teaming up with Phil, Seth? Look so we're going to cast. <laughs> <laughs> I know. You can't beat the counter spells. Yeah. <laughs> there's the squee. And we know they put this deck out of there's a mana drain in here, I know, but it's not in my in hand. In my hand, right here. <laughs> yeah, well, this is this is a moment of truth. This is the we'll game. Listen, the I'm, truth is I don't I'll have get, a counter I that counters so. creatures. And I don't deserve oh, to oh win after this lightning bolt. Yeah, that is. Oh, Siege Gang. Siege oh, is this gang? a, this oh, is a siege oh, gang? That's exact <laughs> Wait, this no, is yeah, enough yeah, you deal with it. Oh, yeah, it is. Because it's five, uh-huh. and then you just have to sacrifice uh-huh. one uh-huh. goblin. Do we have a counter? It's not going to be two You should have mystical <laughs> tutored for the counter spell. Do we have a yeah, counter? Yeah. I mean, yeah. Right. Let's see if I can. Maybe that's a counter with flashback or something. Oh, never mind. What are we milling? No, entombing. <laughs> yeah, maybe. Oh, entombing. Okay. <laughs> okay, okay, yes. Let's see Please tell me this. Oh, do I have to? I don't think there's a flashback counter spell that's four mana. Oh, I hope so, uh, what, what about the mystical, whatever, the one that draws cards? Is it sorcery or instant? The one that lets you tutor an instant. Oh, counter spell oh. is in here. But mana drain is wow. in here. You no, really don't have like, in, here. in hand, though. Oh my god! Oh, oh my goodness! That would have, that would have been brutal with that consecrated <laughs> no, sorcery. Sure. My god! <sighs> no, but then he would have lost because no sure thieves not on me. Oh, that yeah, good to yeah. know. I learned that when Krim got caught by that. He played <laughs> Notion thief in in uh, in response to somebody else's consecrated sphinx, and then he just got milled out. Sorry, mm, I think uh, that is. <sighs> Chat There's the 48 G- land G- cheap chat GPT G- special going to win <laughs> with the sweet It foresaw the counterspells. It foresaw <laughs> yeah. the non-major counterspells. It knew there'd be a Glenelendra, so it put a Siege King in the deck to get around it. <laughs> yeah, let's, let's deck <laughs> them then. <laughs> 5D chessing all of us. It, it would be funny uh, if, it, if Seth was, was the last one to build his deck, so it, it just metagamed us because it knew, it knew all of your decks. <laughs> <laughs> Like Tomer's mono, infamous mono white deck that one uh, that one week, yeah. Oh, oh, God! Oh, does him. this does this save you? Uh, I don't think so. Two mana, you I can sack in response. I just wanna, man, this lightning bolts. I'm sorry, <laughs> viewers. Oh my god! <laughs> Are you sure you so don't want to terminate your own Glenelendra? <laughs> Oh man! So okay, I think Seth saw the line. He clicked his yeah. face. This should be lethal no matter what. Because yeah, even true. if he kills Siege yeah. Gang with on the stack, I can sack yeah, itself yeah, 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 yeah. and then sack the tokens. Wow! Oh my god! I can't. Wow, I usually wow, look wow, at wow. the comments from Commander Clash, but I, I don't think I can <laughs> stop this. this. Not this one. <laughs> <laughs> this time. You can go I ham on me. I believe this. It. I'm actually too gonna read it. I've. I need to feel the pain to learn from my mistakes. Oh, Siege Gang Commander. Siege gang I can't believe this deck won. I cannot believe this. When I saw the deck, I did not think there was any chance, but apparently it, it the was the most GPT. synergistic deck of 
knows Yo, way more all, than me. All your weird cards actually work. 48 together. lands. <laughs> 48 <laughs> lands. Oh, no. It worked. It worked. Oh, well, all you have all you had to do was copy a person's another player's consecrated. That's why we play dual caster mage. <laughs> That's why GPT knew. Yeah, it knew. It knew. I'm voting for Phil. I'm voting for Phil for the lightning bolt. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> Oh, no. Wait, how did Seth get five votes? If there's only four. I, I voted. For I think Seth you get one for winning. Oh. I was gonna. I would have voted Richard, but he played Risk Study, and I could not <laughs> abide. <laughs> okay, right. well we I, got there. I can't believe it. I, 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 I don't want to talk. Oh, no, we're not going to talk about the decks. We're not going to talk about the decks. All right, so that was a wild game. Chat GPT either is brilliant or. <laughs> Well, we don't even know. What, what do you think? What do you think about ChatGPT decks? Uh, let us know in the comments section below. Next week, we're going to be back with a really sweet uh, idea. We're going to be brewing decks again, and we're going to be building the most popular commanders in the format, but wrong. So all those, <laughs> the most popular builds for the most popular formats? No, no, no. We're not doing that. We're going to do the weirdest, jankiest uh, versions of them you'll ever see. So check back next week. Until next time, friends. See ya!